ones. Number one, Adolf Hitler. Bad. bad. All right, unanimously, he's bad. He's bad. Okay, I hear you. Number two, Mother Teresa. Good. Good. All right, wonderful. Moving right along. Martin Luther King Jr. Good. Good. Rosa Parks. Good. Jennifer Lopez. Wait, oh, hi, oh, wait, wait. <laughs> ben Affleck. Oh, mm-hmm. It's a mixed bag. It's a mixed bag. Some say good, some say bad. All right. Biggie Smalls. Okay, mm-hmm. All right. About 75% of y'all say good. Tupac. Okay, all right, all right. Some of my super safe folks said, uh-uh, no, 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 amen, no. No, he's, he's not good. Okay, okay, can I go a step further? Uh, Snoop Dogg. Who said he was bad? Okay, some people say he was bad. All right, all right. I mean, I know he was uh, rolling down the street smoking. Come on, somebody, y'all remember that when he was laid back. I, I, I know he's at the Olympics now, but uh, yeah, yeah. Some people say he's good, some people say he's bad. Okay, uh, Clarence Thomas. Ooh, bad, bad. Man, y'all talk about a Supreme Court justice like that? Katunji Brown Jackson. Donald Trump. Kamala Harris. All right, we got some even standing. Part my sermon off a little bit different today because one thing that I have learned is that what I think is good and what you think is good may not be the same good. Good is relative to all of us based upon our experience and our exposure. And to show you that goodness is not as cut and dry, black and white, as some of us think it is, I'm going to name a few people. And upon naming the few people, I'm not gonna name any of the church members, praise the Lord. I'm gonna name people in society. And once I name them, all I want you to say is whether that person is good or whether that person is bad. Are you ready? Tell your neighbor, get ready, get ready. Here we go. All right, we're going to start with easy questions and then we're going to get to harder ones. Number one, Adolf Hitler. Bad. bad. All right, unanimously, he's bad. He's bad. Okay, I hear you. Number two, Mother Teresa. Good. All right. Wonderful. Moving right along. Martin Luther King Jr. Good. Good. Rosa Parks. Good. Jennifer Lopez. Good. Wait. Oh, hi. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> ben Affleck. Oh, mm-hmm. It's a mixed bag. It's a mixed bag. Some say good. Some say bad. All right. Biggie Smalls. Okay, mm-hmm, all right. About 75% of y'all say good. Tupac! Okay, all right, all right. Some of my super safe folks said, uh-uh, no, 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 amen, no. No, he's, he's not good. Okay, okay, can I go a step further? Uh, Snoop Dogg! Who said he was bad? Okay, some people say he was bad. All right, all right. I mean, I know he was uh, rolling down the street smoking. Come on, somebody. Y'all remember that when he was laid back. I, I, I know he's at the Olympics now, but uh, yeah, yeah. Some people say he's good. Some people say he's bad. Okay, uh, Clarence Thomas. Ooh, bad, bad. Man, y'all talk about a Supreme Court justice like that? Katunji Brown Jackson. Good. Donald Trump. Kamala 
Harris. All right, we got some even standing. All I wanted you to see from that exercise is just because you think somebody good, just because you think something is good, does not mean that it has universal agreement. It's not a consensus among everyone because good and what it means to have goodness is relative. But brothers and sisters, which means that if all of us may have differing opinions on what is good or what is to be considered goodness. That means we have to appeal to a universal truth that is good, rather or not I or you believe that it's good because it's not subjective as we think good is, but we need something objective that is neutral, that will be good irrespective of our opinions. And can I swiftly tell you what that particular objective is? Can I tell you what that neutral particular party is? Can I tell you what that objective tool is that we need to rely on that can tell us what is good whether or not we think it's good or not it is the good book which is the word of can I get a witness in here which is the word of God did you know that B-I-B-L-E stands for basic instructions before leaving earth you didn't know that that's what Bible means. It means that God has given us a good book that has basic instructions before we leave this earth. And, and I like what the Bible says about the Bible to corroborate, to validate, to substantiate that it is a good book. Did you hear in Psalm 119, the psalmist said that, that the word is a lamp to my feet. Number one, Adolf Hitler. Bad. bad. All right, unanimously, he's bad. He's bad. Okay, I hear you. Number two, Mother Teresa. Good. Good. All right, wonderful. Moving right along, Martin Luther King Jr. Good. Good. Rosa Parks. Good. Jennifer Lopez. Good. Wait, hold, oh, hi, oh, wait, wait. <laughs> ben Affleck. Oh, mm hmm. It's a mixed bag. It's a mixed bag. Some say good, some say bad. All right. Biggest Smalls. Okay. Mm hmm. All right. About 75% of y'all say good. Tupac. Okay. All right. All right. Some of my super safe folks said, uh-uh, no, 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 amen, no, no, he's, he's not good. Okay, okay, can I go a step further? Uh, Snoop Dogg. Who said he was bad? Okay, some people say he was bad. All right, all right. I mean, I know he was uh, rolling down the street, smoking. Come on, somebody, y'all remember that when he was laid back. I, I, I know he's at the Olympics now, but uh, yeah, yeah. Some people say he's good, some people say he's bad. Okay, uh, Clarence Thomas. Ooh, bad, bad. Man, y'all talk about a Supreme Court justice like that? Katunji Brown Jackson. Donald Trump. Kamala Harris. All right, got some even standing.